Hey guys, my name is Terry. You know the drill, this is the AXO. It's been a while since we had a gaming chair review. Now uh, this time, this is sent by Sun Cycle. So a big shout out to them for sending over this gaming chair, which is the Tesoro Zone X. Now this is, it comes in black and we're just gonna do a quick install of the chair. Let's not waste any more time and let's get right into the installation. So the box is actually pretty big. Okay, let's see what parts we have here. We have a protective foam on the top back of the chair here. Another layer of protective foam. This one's thicker, user manual. We have the base itself which is aluminum. These are all protected in bubble wrap. This should be the either the lumbar support or the neck support. And we finally get to the base of the chair itself. This is it. Oh, this is a whole workout, guys. Gas strut itself. All the screws, you're gonna need the Allen keys. Chair covers for the side of the chair. This is the gas strut on the bottom, the base. These are the wheels, there's five of them. There's the piston and the protective cover. So I think that's pretty much all that's in the box. Okay, so we have all the parts around us. Let's put on the wheels first. There you go. That is the wheel base. Here. Okay, now that that part's all screwed up, I mean, screwed in, I don't think there's any right way to say that. Um, we're gonna attach the back of the seat to the base. You know one good thing about the installation of the Tesoro Zone X is that the armrests are already screwed on, which is great. So we've got the back and base screwed in. We can now put on the cover on the sides, which is here. So this is the cover. It's gonna clip on here. Then there's another screw to be screwed here. Two more screws here on the side, on the outside of the casing to make sure it locks in. Once that is screwed in, there is the screw hole cover here. One on each side to cover it up. So basically the top half of the chair is done and all that's left to do is to put it onto the wheel chair. Wheel chair. The wheel base. This is the fully assembled Tesoro Zone X. And there you go, the fully assembled Tesoro Zone X. This is the lowest height it can go. Let's go with the tallest. So the armrest here is actually 4D adjustable. It can go on the front, back, left, right. I mean, in and out. And then also down and up. This applies to both sides. As for recline, this is 90 degrees upright, all the way to 155 degree recline. Yes. And when you're laid down like this, 155 degrees, it actually feels natural, very comfortable. And bring the chair up. Okay. Neck rest is adjustable. I am 174 cm's and my weight is 100 kilograms. Highest uh, chair height is a bit too tall because you can see I'm tiptoeing. I think we can go for the lowest. That's the optimal setting for me. A person of my height, 174. Everything feels firm, which is good for now. We've yet to test this out um, extensively because this is still like the first impression and right after the unboxing and set up of the chair. So far, I am liking it. A person of my weight, my bosom is slightly on the big 
thick side. I'm happy to report that whoever has a similar donk donk as mine, uh, this chair's base is wide enough to support maybe bigger thighs or bigger tiny. Can't believe I just came up with a few words just to say the same thing. Cushioning is really firm, um, I can tell from just sitting on it for a while but after extensive review we might come back to this maybe half a year later just to see how well it holds up over time and over like daily uh, use of the chair so that is all for this video on the tesoro zone x we hope you enjoyed the video as much as i enjoyed making it and you know setting the whole thing up or if you're looking for a gaming chair, uh, has a wide chair base, uh, firm cushioning, you know, for the adjustable armrest, the Tesoro Zone X, I would recommend it. My name is Terry. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. We will seat you in the next one.